Now let's head to Kilifi, where salt producing farms in Kilifi County have decried high taxation rates by the government, claiming that they are hindering their production. According to Kansal's manager in charge of production and civil works maintenance, Gilbert Mwinga, he said that the company has been forced to operate at a high level cost of production because of the exorbitant taxes levied to them by several government agencies. The company says a combination of policies have hindered its expansion and potential to export to new markets. We are, we are, we are also uh, uh, boggled in uh, some, some situations where uh, some other government departments are demanding so much uh, taxes, like water and water management or these people. They're demanding so much taxes that if you put it into, the, into our, our cost of production, it will make this salt more expensive. It will mean it will be more, uh, it will not be able to, to meet our, 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 our the, 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 the common minds are able to buy it. So some of these, uh, some of the other people, they don't understand the problems that we're facing. And you see, salt production depends on weather. Weather, we normally have, weather that is almost uh, going to favor us, like droughts. But normally when we have rain season, we don't like, we find it very difficult to meet the demand. All right, uh, still on matters manufacturing. Currently, manufacturing contributes approximately 7.2% of the country's GDP. Efforts